Well, we're having some issues with the uh, 2007 Buick Lucerne. Uh, the other day my wife complained that the turn signal chimes and the door chimes and the seatbelt chimes were barely audible, real quiet. Uh, I checked everything out, couldn't find anything wrong. And then this morning, she called me and said the car would crank, but it wouldn't start. But when I got home, I checked battery voltage. I was down to about 11, 11 volts, so I put charger on it. And it's nothing changed. I'm trying to figure out what's going on. I hooked up my scanner again. Tons and tons of codes. I mean, it's packed full of codes. So I'm starting to look around. I'm doing voltage tests. I'm thinking, what on earth is wrong? And then I noticed up here on my insulation, there's a couple marks on each side that I'd never seen before. And then I started seeing this stuff laying around my car. And then when I went over here, we got problems. Some rodent has chewed the snot out of my wiring harness. And I also found some insulation back there. So that's probably why my car doesn't start. And this plastic hose here, he totally destroyed that too. So I have no idea what else he destroyed. Uh, I have seen some squirrels around, and we used to have some chipmunks. We live right in a, you know, subdivision, so I have not ever seen any mice or rats around here. So I'm not sure what chewed that. But instead of working on one bid or Project 66R, I'll be working on the 2007 Buick Lucerne, which apparently has become very tasty to rodents. There's the evidence that I've been looking for. Squirrel hair. Yep. And I noticed he ate all my insulation, most of it, off my firewall under my air conditioning unit. Hopefully he didn't taste my heater hoses. So I'm not sure what else is going on here. But you can see the scratch marks on the hoses there. He was climbing around. I don't see any other chewed wires so far. But I'm going to have to go underneath and look at this car from one end to the other. There are pieces of wire all under my car. I can't believe that he chewed off all that wire. No rodent eats my wiring and lives to tell about it. Let's hope he doesn't eat the rest of it before morning when I can fix it. <laughs>